Streets Ball honors Vaccaro and White. If you've ever been struck by a driver in New York, you know that law enforcement often isn't on your side. But Steve Vaccaro and Adam White always are. Vaccaro and White have made a career fighting for institutional changes to protect all New Yorkers who walk or bike. They've helped New Yorkers understand their rights when stopped by police for a bogus ticket. They've won back huge sums of money for cyclists who were fined excessive amounts by the DMV. They've exposed NYPD's shoddy crash investigations and corrected police accounts that mistakenly blamed victims. They helped rewrite the laws of New York City to strengthen the legal protections for pedestrians and cyclists. They've generously supported Streets Blog, Street Films, and many other organizations working to make New York City safer for walking and biking. We thank you, Adam and Steve. Streets Ball honors Mujeres en Movimiento. Mujeres en Movimiento began when a group of Spanish-speaking mothers in Corona, Queens came together to get more physical activity. They quickly became a powerful voice for streets where people of all ages can safely walk and bike in their community. For the last few years, they have fought for a redesign of 111th Street in Corona so neighborhood families can have safe access to Flushing Meadows Corona Park. It hasn't been easy, but they persevered and were the moral anchor of the campaign for a safer 111th Street. Instead of a highway cutting people off from the park, Corona now has safer pedestrian crossings and a two-way protected bike lane connecting families to this important public space. We thank you, Mujeres en Movimiento. Streets Ball honors Charles Komanov. Charles Komanov is a unique figure in the history of livable streets advocacy. This year marks the 30th anniversary of Mayor Ed Koch's attempt to ban bicycles in Midtown Manhattan, which was never implemented because Komanov helped fend it off as president of Transportation Alternatives. Komanov went on to co-author the ambitious Bicycle Blueprint, which has influenced bike policy in New York for more than two decades. And his pioneering 1999 report, Killed by Automobile, exposed data about the impacts of dangerous driving that police were keeping under wraps. For the last 10 years, Komanoff has made the case for reducing traffic on New York City streets via road pricing, which he continues to push for on behalf of the Move New York Toll Reform Plan. Charlie, we thank you for your years of service.